have three fundamental values that lead this school. So we've got aspiration, we've got commitment, we've got success. And those are key to driving the school and the aspirations of the children. But underneath that, we've got trust, we've got honesty, we've got integrity, we've got respect, and we've got tolerance. And I believe that those are the key values that I want to run this school when dealing with staff, when dealing with individuals. So if we look after the staff that look after the children, then I believe that the outcomes will take care of themselves. We greatly value our staff here at Crown Hills Community College. So from from government down to the the soft touch elements that we that we provide here at Crown Hill. So if we, if we look at governments and, and policies, so whether it is around accessibility, uh, disabilities, equal opportunities, through to health surveys, uh, staff surveys, working with unions, supporting teaching unions. So yes, as a school, we need to ensure we have the right policies in place. We also need to ensure we have the right support mechanisms just between ourselves. We're here to support the learning and give our children the best opportunities and give them the, the inspiration to go out and become skilled people within, within the community or further afield. So we need staff on board, we need to invest in staff, we need to ensure that they're cared for. Having multiple people that you know are there for you it's fantastic because you get a range of opinions and it's only going to improve you as a teacher. Uh, the training which the college has provided has been great. I identified not only my strengths but also areas for improvement. So after discussions with my mentor, we identified how I could improve in these areas and then make the changes for the next observation. But overall, the school's been fantastic. We support teachers and support staff at every stage of their career because we think it's important to invest in people so that whatever their career ambitions are, we can support them with those. Well, I feel I'm supported and encouraged to go on any training courses, uh, conferences and meetings which will guide me in my role and when I bring back ideas, new systems or developments from these meetings to implement it's valued and, and I'm well supported. We work really hard to ensure that the curriculum has breadth and depth. So the core subjects have an enhanced time allocation, but alongside that we've been really, really careful and passionate to ensure that we maintain the breadth. So subjects such as the arts and the design and our life skills curriculum are there alongside the core subjects, giving students every opportunity to experience a range of subjects and a range of experiences so that they really can be the best that they can be. Being a staff governor has given me the opportunity to question, contribute and challenge in discussions and decision making about present and future plans for the college development. It allows the staff who are key stakeholders to have a voice so that they can contribute to the development of the college. Currently I'm a middle leader and that just doesn't feel quite enough for me, I want to do more. So um, I spoke to, to Farhan, the senior leadership team, and I asked them what programmes can you put me on that will help me, that will create a platform for me to kind of use my visions and ideas and develop my leadership. So Crown Hills have been absolutely fantastic in supporting me. They've come up with a little bit of research which I was then able to choose which programme that I decided uh, kind of fitted with me and my needs and I chose the Schools Ambitions Leadership Programme which is a two year programme, it's quite intense with lots of residentials uh, but it's a, a platform for me to kind of move forward and put some of my ideas into practice. I'm currently completing an internship at Crown Hills as an Associate Assistant Principal. It's a substantive role leading on pupil premium, an area I chose to focus on as part of the application process. The role is providing the challenge and responsibility I need and want as a middle leader. It's definitely providing the platform I need in my quest to gain a permanent SLT position. I'm guided through the process of leading at a senior level. I have one-to-one -one coaching and am line managed by the principal. He empowers me to believe I can make a difference and encourages me to take full responsibility in decision making at the highest level. My advice to any potential candidate was, is to come and have a look at what we do. Um, some of the things I recommend is that you come and visit us, come and have a conversation with us, come and have a look at the school, see what it's about, find out what this school is, is, is truly you know, about in terms of delivering a high quality education.